When she was a young girl, Joanna overheard a dinner guest share the gospel with her parents. She knew in her heart that what she heard was true. During her military service, she got connected to other believers and the seed of faith that was planted when she was a child began to grow and flourish. Joanna now manages a Joshua Fund distribution center alongside her husband and finds her purpose in giving to others. I've always believed that the act of giving is important. Jesus teaches us to give, and I've always felt that God has put the desire to give inside of me, that He has given me the gift of giving. Johanna is reaching those who feel lost and forgotten, especially young women and refugee families. She provides hope for girls who have been disowned or abandoned by their families by finding a temporary home for them, helping them get jobs, and doing what she can to support them as they build a new life. We give a lot of love and hugs, and I always tell them that everything is okay. God is in control. The distribution center also allows Johanna to make a significant impact in her community. Living in a low-income area that is home to refugees and immigrants who are not Israeli citizens, the needs around her are great. These families, first of all, they're foreigners in the land. And not long ago, I experienced what it is to be a foreigner from another country, Ethiopia. So God always tells me to give to the foreigner. I think that the deep distress that they're in is what drew me to them. At the moment, what I do with these refugees, it stems from how many of them came to Israel as single parent families that are in pieces, families that don't have any work. Even when they do find work, they are often paid less due to their non-citizen status. The life they envisioned is not their reality, causing them to live in despair as they struggle to make ends meet. Johanna brings hope and light to the dark circumstances they face, handing out her food packs with a bright smile, many hugs, and telling recipients that God loves them and that He will take care of them. When someone comes to you and tells you, I'm hungry, I don't have anything at home, help me. These words that come out of a person's mouth, I can't just cross my arms and say, I'll pray for you. This is what drew me. There is a deep need here. We are honored to partner with Johanna and others like her who are serving the least of these. It is through your generosity that we are able to make a difference in Johanna's community and throughout the epicenter. First of all, I want to say thank you. Thank you to all of you that thought about these people. I believe that your giving comes from your love for God. Every gift, every little thing, every few cents brings joy to people. It brings real food to people. So God bless you for all that you are doing and increase what you may even be lacking in. I know that many give from what they themselves are lacking in. So God bless you.
We want to highlight one of the partners who serves as a distribution center manager, distributing food and serving those in need in her community. Johanna works with many refugees who come to Israel with nothing and struggle to make ends meet in their new country. In her community, many need support, and Johanna faithfully serves them, bringing hope in light through practical humanitarian aid. By giving food packs that are supplied by the Joshua Fund, she is able to touch the lives of the downtrodden and overlooked. Johanna hands out her food packs with a bright smile and many hugs and tells recipients God loves them and He will take care of them.